Let's find some joy in 60. A few years ago, I took our 4x4 out into the woods in the middle of nowhere without telling anyone where I was going. It was an area that was closed for winter. And as I came over a hill, I suddenly found myself stuck in some deep snow. I tried everything I could to get out, but nothing was working. So I said a short prayer. I said, Lord, I've made an awful mistake. Please help me get out of here. And as I said the words in Jesus' name, amen, instantly I heard a truck. And I started to run after the truck, but I didn't need to go after it. It was coming to me. You see, my uncle Roger had heard a voice about 40 minutes before that told him to take this back road into town. Even though it was way out of his way, he listened to the voice of God and he helped pull me out. 1 Peter chapter 5, verse 6 and 7 tells us to humble ourselves under the mighty hand of God so that he may exalt us and to cast all of our cares upon him because he cares for us. Whether it's our dumb mistakes or our sins, give them to Jesus and he'll bring us joy. So rejoice in the Lord always. And again, I say rejoice.